Hello everybody, this is Maniac for Bricks, and I apologize that there hasn't been any video uploads on my channel today. I know I was supposed to put up day number 18, but I didn't really get time to it, because I was busy 8am doing an exam in college. My, my last exam for the semester, so I'm glad that's over with. I hope I do a good job on it. There was all essays too. Anyways, I had that, then I came home, I tried to relax a little bit, and then I was, um... And then I had to run back out because I had to pick up some more things for Christmas items. Didn't find anything though, unfortunately. But I did find some interesting things in my travels for today's haul video. And these are all actual things that I went around and shopped for. So we'll see what that's all about. Long story short of what I first recorded for this. This is the second take. These are items that I found in Walgreens and in Kmart, but we're going to start with Kmart first because it's a bigger batch. Got one, two, three, four poly bags. Four poly bags and a partridge. Yeah. Anyways, four poly bags. I found a Kmart. Roughly a good price each. They're all in my Bricklink store. They've been up all day, actually, in the Bricklink store. And, uh,. Some of these I didn't find in other places. This one I only know being at one Kmart, the one I went to today. So I was like, yeah, I'll pick them up. I've seen them before, but, you know, I decided, yeah, I'll come back and pick them up today. So, nice, nice little poly bags. These are part of the poly, happy poly days on my Bricklink store. Enjoy it, guys. Nice stocking stuffers. I'm not just saying that. I think they're good for stocking stuffers. Oh, <laughs> look what snuck into my bag. This little exclusive SpongeBob SquarePants Mega Blocks figure. And I got this for a special person. In case you don't know, you'll see it at a later time. But yes, a special person, and I think might enjoy it. They haven't seen it in their own stores. They don't have it as far as I know. Well, you know, they'll find something to do with it. Next, I went to the clearance aisle, and I saw a few things. This will clear up some confusion that Brick Stackers has about Kmart clearance, because. You know, sometimes the prices don't make sense. This is a Lego Duplo planes set. I was about to say cars. Um, its sticker price is $14.99 clearance. But it was also in an aisle that said, take an additional 40% off any stickered price. So 40% off of $14.99 actually showed up on the receipt. It was about $8.99 that I paid for this. <coughs> Sorry. Got something caught in my throat. So, not too bad of a price. I will review it, and it will be put into the Brooklyn store, because I'm sure you guys will enjoy it more than I will. Um, that's what I'm That's what I'm here for. You guys will enjoy it. <clears throat> Next up, I have another item I found in the clearance aisle. It's a Zip Bin Lin uh, Chima Speed Ors case. I will also review that. And it shows up on here $12, but 40% off of that $12, again, roughly $8.99 or so. I forget how much exactly, but still good to get a little bit less. Also, it's on the Bricklink store, but I will review it before I actually sell it. Um, it's, it's planning to go to the Bricklink store because, you know, it's a nice little case. And I think on the tag, it actually says something. It claims, oh, the original price is $14.99. Clearance says twelve dollars. Actually paid like eight ninety nine. It says on the the little tag in here holds four hundred bricks. So even if you're not using it for Chima, it's just a nice zip zip up storage container. Can't argue with that. Now we have some things I found in Walgreens. If I find the right bag for it, I don't know where it went. Oh, it's right here. Sorry. <laughs> it's it's you guys know it's getting messy around here. But I found some interesting things because um, I looked in the toy aisle, tried to look for some Lego. They have Series 12, but they have them for like $4 or more. Kind of a ripoff. Not that I need them anymore, but I'd rather go elsewhere. Um, we have one... Hold on. I gotta get the rest out of the bag. Two, three Speed Ore sets from Lego Legends of Chima. Why? Because there were four twenty-four each, these actually didn't say on them that they were that clearance price of seventy-five percent off the original price. 
but they were classified with the other speed ores from like the nest dive and the you know some of the earlier ones that I've shown on this channel as well as shown on Instagram they were put in the same category so they still got that percent off which is great because now I can review these and I didn't feel like I spent a whole bunch of money so there's my haul it's actually pretty big compared to some other ones um, I will have a whole bunch of reviews at least five reviews out of this haul alone I still have plenty more to work on uh, I know I I know I got a lot of stuff I gotta do and honestly I I can't stop thinking about you know what I have to do for the channel and what's coming up next also I'd like to take this moment to say because I didn't really put up a bricklink vlog about it I now have more Duplo in my bricklink store all this Duplo from Bob the Builder they're in used condition but they are still good they're nicely clean um, and they're nice, you know, nice little pieces. They got the original profile brick, <laughs> as Brickstar called it. Also, behind there, any Technic, Bionicle, and some sports stuff are 15% off in my store right now because of Bionicle 2015. So, January 20, January 15th, 2015 is when the sale will end, so pick them up now while you can. They're nice things to add to your Bionicle when you get them, if you plan to get them in 2015. They're also the nice additions for Hero Factory, just to make it more original for what you can make, because they don't give you a lot of parts. So thank you for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to check out my Bricklink store for parts and sets you may need. Hashtag Happy Poly Days. And you guys know I'm going to be busy with reviewing, so I'll try to get to that, and I'll see you later. I'll also try to get up the Advent Calendar review uh, the the day 18 in a reasonable time too.